my YouTube channel. In this week's video, I will be doing a pretty quick review and demo of the Playtex Diaper Genie Complete, as you can see, standing right beside me. I'll start off by saying this diaper pail retails for around $27 to $30, obviously depending on where you purchase it. The height of this is 27 inches and it weighs approximately 8 pounds. No, just so you can have a better picture, let me give you a 360. So this is what it looks like all around. That's what the back looks like. And I'm sure you can notice that there's a foot pedal as well. This feature is amazing because obviously you do not have to bend to throw your diapers in there. You just step on it, throw your diapers in, and you go. So that part is great. Another great feature of this diaper pail is that it has odor lock protection. So whenever you step on the foot pedal, you'll notice that it doesn't just come with the lid, it has this circular thing on the inside where when you step on it, it opens, it receives your diaper and it brings it down into the bottom compartment and then you close the lid. Also, according to the description, it says that it has a carbon filter that's supposed to be this thing right here. Um, I don't know if that's the filter or not, or if I'm supposed to put something in there. I guess you could put air freshener in there if you want, but I can definitely say that's not something you need because as long as your diapers are in it, you will not have a smell. The only time you'll smell anything is when you open the diaper pail. As soon as you close it, that's pretty much it. Now, at this point, I'm going to demonstrate how to insert the refills. Now, this refill that I have here, there are two refills in this and of course, the brand is that of the Diaper Genie. There are several other brands that you can use for refills and they work just as fine. You just have to do your research and majority of the time, they cost less. So, it's up to you to decide which refills you want to use. Now, I'm just going to cut this open. So this is one single refill, this is what it looks like and we're going to go ahead and pull at this little thing that you see right here and you pull it all the way around, you get rid of this part. And then as you can see the bags are inside. So you're just going to pull on the bag. So these are the bags that your diapers will be stored in. You're going to make a tie and of course we do not want to waste our bags. So we're going to make the tie as close to the bottom as we can. And this tie is going to be the bottom of your bag. Now you're going to push this back through the center like this and then you're gonna notice that there's a little slot right in here so you're going to sit it down right in that slot now after you sit it down in the slot you are going to step on the pedal ensure that the bag goes right through the hole Then you're going to open this compartment right here. You can remove it if you want, but I'll just let it stay. And you'll pull your bag right through until it touches the bottom. And that's pretty much it. You close it back and there you go. Your diaper genie is ready to be used. In order to empty your diaper pail, all you have to do is open the compartment. You can lift it out. And there you see your dirty diapers. You give it a little twisty twist. And of course, there's a cutter that's included. You can see the blades inside. And you just pull your diaper bag through. As easy as that. And next, you make a tie. And there you have it. 
Now, according to the company, each refill holds around 270 diapers. Um, what I will say is that each bag, when you're ready to throw it out, it holds approximately 30 diapers because I counted it. Um, my baby is four months old, so when I ball up her diapers, it's probably the size of my fist and that's about 30. Just so you have an idea how many diapers each bag will hold before you have to cut it and throw it out. I can definitely say that this diaper pail has been very very helpful for me. I personally love it. Should you get it, that's dependent on you. If you can find an alternate means to dispose of your diapers, then that's completely up to you. But I feel like this is a good investment to have. You keep your diapers in there maybe for like a day or two, depending, depending on how many diapers your baby uses and you throw it out so that's pretty much it it has no smell i can definitely say that for a fact you won't smell the dirty diapers so that's a plus okay i think that's pretty much it for my review i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did give this video a thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next one